A raging early morning fire destroys a bowling alley in the southwest suburbs. CBS 2's Noel Brennan is in Oak Forest, where people have been coming out all day to get a look at the damage, Noel. Yeah, Dana, we have watched this evening as several members of the community and regulars at Oak Forest Bowl have come out here. They are stunned. They are in disbelief seeing what is left of a place they loved. And when you look behind me and you see the damage here, you can just imagine the intensity of that fire. And we have video of it as it was raging overnight. We know that it broke out just about 2.30 in the morning. When fire crews got there, it was just erupting from all sides of the building. Firefighters from 12 other towns had to come in to help fight those flames of a three alarm fire. The manager of the bowling alley says he and another employee saw the fire, they ran outside. The flames, they say, seemed to spread just within minutes. In fact, as that bowling alley manager was talking to a photographer on scene, a portion of the roof actually collapsed during that interview. Earlier we thought the fire was contained, but looking at it now, it looks like it's getting pretty worse and everything. Oh, it just collapsed, part of it just collapsed. Just amazing to see that happen. We have met people that bowl in leagues here. We've met the high school coach uh, at Bremen High School. He coaches the girls bowling uh, league, the bo girls bowling team rather. And this, this place is their home away from home. This is not just a bowling alley. There's a restaurant here. There is a beer garden, beer garden out back. This drew a whole bunch of people out here from the community and all of them, many of them are coming out here just devastated and saddened to see this loss to the community. We're in Oak Forest, Noel Brennan, CBS 2 News. Noel, quick question for you. Do we have any idea of what caused the fire? At this point, Dana, they are still investigating the cause of that fire, but you could see from that video just how intense it was and how quickly it spread. Yeah, glad no one was hurt, though, no. Thank you.